quarter pound hamburger patty. It may not look like much to you, but in my business, it's a fucking gold mine. In this town, the fast food racket was controlled by two guys, a couple of clowns named Jack and Mickey D. They ran it all until I got here. My name's Bobby. I sell a million cheeseburgers a year. Welcome to Bobby's. May I take your order? Hmm. Uh, what do I want? Oh, I should be good and have a chicken sandwich. Uh, that's fat free, right? <laughs> oh, I can't decide. Pube salad. Jesus Christ. Back in the old days, it was simple. Cheeseburger, fries, and a Coke. Now it's all you can eat salad bars, tacos, chicken, Chinese, low fat, no fat, fat free, MSG, no MSG. And everybody's got to have it their own special way. I'm sorry, sir, we don't have salads. Don't have salads? <sighs> oh, if I have to, I'll have a cheeseburger with no pickles and, and just a touch of mayo. Would you like fries with that? Hmm. What kind of oil do you use? Is it cholesterol free? Nowadays, it takes some goddamn idiot two hours to order. It's bad for business. That's where Joey comes in. He's the best night manager around. All right, what's the fucking hold up here? He's asking a bunch of questions. All right, what the fuck are you, huh? Larry King? Huh? Why are you asking so many fucking questions? Order already, you finicky fuck. You wouldn't see him treat a customer like this at Jack's. Yeah, that's because he's a clown in a box. Would you like to be in a box, huh? Do you think I'm a clown, huh? Do I make you laugh? Am I, am I here to amuse you? What's so fucking funny about me, huh? Look, I just take a cheeseburger. Uh, hold the pickles. Hold the pickles? Yeah, I'll hold the pickles. I'll hold the oh. fucking pickles. Oh, I'll hold the fucking oh. pickles and get your fucking skull, you fitting oh. fuck! After that, we had very few complaints. But when we did... Hey, where's the beef? We referred them to our customer complaint department. Joey protecting me, the lunch rush never stopped. And we made a fortune. Still, I had to stay on top of every detail. Hey, you, come over here. Hey, from now on, I want you to put an equal amount of sesame seeds on each bun. Put an equal amount of sesame seeds on each bun. Do you know how long that's going to take? I don't care how long it takes. Do it. Sorry, sir, it won't happen again. You got them right, it won't happen again. Listen to me very carefully. There's three ways of doing things around here. The right way, the wrong way, and the way that I do it. Put an equal amount of sesame seeds on each bun. Do it. I knew everything there was to know about the fast food business. But I wasn't the only one. There was me and Joey, and there was Frankie Bicarbonate. Hey, close the dish. And there was Mo Howard's brother, Fat Anthony. Hey, when are we gonna get those curly fries, huh? Sweetly! No, no, no. And his guys, Frankie the Mop and Freddie Ammonia. Hey, I called that guy. I got the ketchup. And then there was Pete the Killer, who was Sally Sauerkraut's cousin. I took care of that thing for you. And Ronnie repeat that. He worked the drive-thru. Always made the customers order two times. Would you repeat that, please? Repeat that! And then there was Cookie, Brownie, and Connie Cupcakes. The guys called her that because... Because she's got these big, big cupcakes, huh? Ah! Cookie! <laughs> Fast food is a tough business. Tough. If you can't take it, get out. Get out. My French fries. I was not stealing your French fries. Get lost. How about that? Everybody's got to watch everybody else. The customer's watching the cashier to make sure she ain't shortchanging them. The 
cashier's watching the soda fountain to see if her drink order's being filled. The soda girl's watching the burger guy because she likes his ass. The burger guy's watching the clock because he wants a fucking break. The assistant manager's supposed to be watching the burger guy, but instead he's watching the new girl because he wants a piece. The new girl's watching the assistant manager watching her tits. And Joey's watching everything. Actually, Joey's just staring out the window. Hey, Joey, come on! I'm checking out the drive through, you fat bastard! Hey. Man, take your order. Take your order. Yeah, we'll have. Oh, what are you doing? Don't order. I, I didn't tell you to order. Just sit. I didn't tell you to do anything. I just told you to pull up to the drive through window. I'm just gonna sit here. Just sit. See the woman in the window? Hmm? Over there, the woman. By the window. What, are you blind? Do you see her? Yeah. You know who the woman is? Huh? Uh, I mean, you, you don't know who she is, but uh, do you know who she is? Huh? My wife. That's not our table. She's eating chicken nuggets. And I'm gonna kill her. You think I'm crazy, don't you, huh? <laughs> well, I am. And I'm hungry, too. Let's order. We might do order now. You talking to me? You talking to me? Who the fuck you think you're talking to? You talking to me? Joey and I ran the best burger joint in town. We had it all. It was paradise. Until one day, when we fucked it all up. Hey, Joey. What happened that night at the Golden Arches with you and Sharon, huh? Well, that time I had Jack's head in the box, I was banging it back and forth, I told you about that. It's not what I heard, Joe. It's not what you heard. What'd you hear? I heard things. You heard things. What things did you hear? I heard things. What things? You heard things about uh, me and Sharon. We had to go downtown and settle the whole thing with Mickey D. You know, it's all forgiven. You eat his burger? What? You eat his burger? How can you ask me that? I'm your night manager. How can you ask me that? Where you get bulls big enough to ask me that? You're very smart, Joey. You give me a lot of answers, but you ain't give me the right answer. Now I'm gonna ask you again. Did you or did you not? Just tell me. I'm not gonna answer. It's a sick question, you're a sick fuck, and I ain't sick enough that I'm gonna answer. I'm gonna leave. Now give me my paycheck. No. No? What do you mean, no? No, Joey, no means no, no. As a matter of fact, I think you should leave. You want me to leave my own restaurant? You low-life, fast food, two all beef patty, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on a sesame seed bun, fuck ya! You only exist out here because of me! Deep, greasy, fat, frying, fuck ya! The word was out. Joey was a great night manager, but we had to get rid of him. Where the fucking buns? How come I can't find him? Let me see buns, eh? I'm cranky! He forgot the cardinal rule of the fast food business. Always watch your buns. Hey! Hey, what do you want me to do with him? Make him the special. right where I started. I could still make burgers for the bosses back home. So, that's that. Two cheeseburgers! Two cheeseburgers! 